Angula believes there was a need to explore consensus with descendants of the victims who feel sidelined and to stimulate unity instead of agreeing on an $18.6 billion genocide deal between Namibia and Germany. In addition, he says colonial crimes against humanity are a global phenomenon which, if handled correctly, have an ability to foster reconciliation. The former Prime Minister was speaking during a tribute to the late Kazanambo at his residence in Okahanja. There was supposed to be a national consensus on this before we approached the, the Germans. Unfortunately, <coughs> that did not happen. And uh, that didn't happen. Some people felt sidelined. They felt belittled. They felt left out. And that's why we have this stalemate now. It's unfortunate. But this is a critical issue. It's a national issue. And uh, perhaps we should go back to the drawing board and start a dialogue, a national dialogue on restorative justice. In addition, Angula says even though he did not always necessarily agree with the late Kazanambo's views on issues, he says he immensely benefited from his perspective. One such issue is a historic proposed moratorium in the National Assembly on the return of descendants of the genocide from the diaspora, especially Botswana, which a visibly irate Kazanambo vehemently rejected.